Hello, my name is Dr. Paul Gosney and I'd like to introduce you to organic psychiatry. Organic psychiatry describes a group of psychiatric conditions which have an underlying physical cause. They're important to rule out in any patient presenting with psychiatric symptoms and they come at the top of our diagnostic pyramid. The reason for their importance is there may be a reversible medical condition underneath which can be treated. Missing organic conditions can lead to significant brain damage in a patient or the long-term use of antipsychotics or detention in a mental health hospital which would be inappropriate and potentially damaging to the patient. The kinds of conditions we're thinking about are delirium, dementia, epilepsy and head injury. Delirium is a significant condition affecting many people in general hospital beds. It presents as acute confusion and agitation with maybe visual hallucinations and there's a treatable medical cause underlining it. The chronically confused patient presenting in older age may well have dementia, but there are other causes of chronic confusion and we need to rule those out. Alzheimer's and vascular dementia account for the vast majority of cases of dementia in this country. And I'll be looking in more detail at Alzheimer's and vascular dementia. I'll be explaining the differences between cortical and subcortical dementias and outlining the mechanism of drugs that we can use in Alzheimer's dementia. There may be a role for medications in vascular dementia as well. And finally, I'll be looking at head injury and how head injury can present with psychiatric symptoms and epilepsy and the manifestations of psychiatric symptoms in epilepsy.